far as the weather, hey, it couldn't have been better the last several days. But today's the day we're going to start to see some changes arriving on the Gulf Coast. The air is going to become a bit more muggy. We'll have a little bit of drizzle out there this afternoon. Not much, but it's all going to be in advance of a cold front that will make things rather chilly by the conclusion of this week. Let's jump right now into what we've got on the radar. No rain out there, and even though there is a little chance for some pocket of rain this afternoon, we're not going to see anything this morning. Everything is going to stay rain free. The only issue you're going to have this morning is some patchy fog. Every county in the viewing area is again underneath a dense fog advisory that will expire once we hit 9 o'clock this morning. And then after that time, the only thing we're going to have to watch is a little light rain in spots, and that's just going to come as the moisture levels begin to rise. Southerly flow out of the Gulf is continuing to pump all of that muggy air in, but the front is going to knock it all out by tomorrow. And you do see the showers showing up in advance of the front. We will end up seeing that impact our area by tomorrow afternoon. The threat for showers will be 40% as this thing blows through, and there will be a few rumbles of thunder in the mix, but not that many. And then we'll end up on the back edge of the front by the time we hit tomorrow night. We'll end up dry for the rest of the week, but we will turn much cooler. Right now in the port city, you have 59 degrees, Pascagoula 55, so the temperatures aren't too bad right now. Fairhope 55, Daphne 66, Theodore at 62, low 60s around Loxley and Summerdale, 59s from Foley all the way to Alberta. Lillian, you've got 58, Pensacola at 60. Here's how the future cast breaks this down. We do stay dry through the morning. We'll stop the clock at about 3 this afternoon, and there's your low end rain chance. We're only keeping the probability of rain at 10% for today. Any showers that do show up are going to be gone almost as quickly as they arrive. Tonight will end up dry, but we are going to see muggy air continue to hold, with lows tonight only dropping into the low 60s. So the high today between about 81 and 79. Clouds increase. We'll have a light southwest wind. Overnight tonight, we are mostly cloudy with lows in the mid to lower 60s. The winds calm. Tomorrow is going to be the better chance for rain and a few thunderstorms along the front. And then look what happens with the temperatures. We drop to 58 Wednesday night. The high Thursday and Halloween Friday, only 75. But the high Saturday, only 68 degrees. Much cooler air pumping in. The low Saturday night gets down to 43. And we will fall back on Saturday night. Daylight saving time will end and standard time will return. I'll have another forecast update for you coming up at 530. Eric.